Oh, okay, good. I've got to get this heart to Rita to make it up to her. You've always been a failure. So what, are we gonna need some glue? Wait, how do you get out? Glue. I guess we better go back to odd jobs and say, You let the silly owl go! Yeah, seriously. We could do that if we want to, it's probably just optional. Just go back in on them and be like, It's not my fault! Yeah. I actually kinda wanna go see what he would say if we did. Of course, it is all the way back at the beginning, so would it be worth right. it? <laughs> you think it's worth it or not? Let's see, the mermaid you can pick up. An octopus and a fish. Like yeah. that. If you break me, I won't stop working. If you can touch me, my work is done. If you lose me, you must find me for ring soon again. Or soon after. That works too. We're putting the hearts of nature together. Apparently, that rhyme means that. Well, okay. One more piece. One more piece. That piece. Win. That's all we need to do. That was. That's nice. I'm not complaining. Oh yeah. Take this gift as well. Now go. Here, some Reese's pieces. No, I don't know what that is. It's a uh, door lock, of course. <laughs> to this door that we've been ignoring for a while, I believe. Yep. But first, oh, nice. we're gonna go see Mr. Oddjobs. He let that little owl thing go. Can we actually leave the entrance, though? I think we can walk. I'm gonna walk as far back as we can go. I hope he has dialogue, because if he doesn't, then this is gonna be sad. I honestly don't know, though. Sure, we never tried. I'm sure the lady inside of us is just like, What the hell are you doing? Get back there! Don't let something. me keep you. He's apparently still here. That makes no sense. Like, ha 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 That makes oh, no sense. Oh, broke the plot. That makes no sense. This is the wrong way. We just broke, like, all the logic. Well, I'm glad I checked. Now, let's see, can I use the map to jump from here? That's Rita's place, no need to go back there. Hang on, we gotta walk. Oh, there, it's pretty much, we're, there. I can't imagine we're like, uh, Now we can jump. To here. This has to be pretty much it. Once we get in this room, this is like the last room. I may not have yeah. the power to bring Oberon's army into this world, but I can bring the king himself. So mighty Oberon, come forth. I like the new look. Here it was like, what? Did you really think you could fool me? Now, the heart! Use it! Nah, okay. Take that, somehow. Um... No, apparently. Oh, is it matching? Yeah, it's matching the stuff. Hair? Yeah, okay. Guys sitting, people fighting. And now we have to put these together. Um, probably the candle and the book. And serving the king. And then the guy and the crazy girl. Seems like we should have done this beforehand if we knew we needed to do that. Oh, okay, we completed the stop reading the needle rod again. Yay, we're holding a heart. Or something. Nah, now that the heart is in its rightful place, world. both worlds are safe. 
there will be no invasion. My people will remain in their realm. And as for you... I thought revenge was mine. But it was stolen from me. At least now that all your medical friends are gone, I can get revenge on you. No. Nope. <laughs> well, I told you I'd keep an eye out. It'll stop her. And that's it. And that was all a story, too. Because we just came out of the book. Well, that was Mist of the Worlds of Fiends and Fairies. How about that? My first Mist of the World game, and probably the only reason I'm continuing the, the series. I honestly did not think it'd be this good. Yeah. Well, some of the hidden object games were kind of annoying, but besides that, I really got into the story a bit. What'd you think? Yeah, I think it was pretty cool. I think the ending was a little, um, boring, but oh well. The, the, the journey was a bit good, though. Yeah. Yeah, it just kind of seemed anticlimactic, which is like, oh, you know what? We have this heart that kills you all. So, man. <laughs> yeah. You now I look at all the Serbian people who made this game. Yeah, there's a few really people here. Towards the end. Seems like most of the people who make the games that we play aren't in the in, in the United States except for Interactive. Yeah, because they're based in Washington, I believe. Yeah, Washington. Yeah, otherwise, just like, um... Here we have, like, Ivan Zinkovic, Rajkonikolik, Milos Dorovsky. Yeah, it's just like, okay. I mean, thanks for at least making games that we can play. Yeah, they did a pretty good job, but there's a lot of detail in this game, too. I would agree. I mean, yeah, even from the first one they did, it was a really pretty good-looking game. Right, why haven't we re been reading these quotes about all this stuff? I don't know, there's someone some, takes the some time to put them together. Yeah. Every game, too, I'm pretty sure. And I'm kind of wanting to check out the cast in a minute. So where are we? Are we any actors? No, I did That's department. right, because there were voice actors. Yeah, they did pretty good, too. They really helped make the characters come alive. I don't think we could have done this good job if there weren't. Huh. Oh, here we go. Characters. Oh, wait, it's just the people who played the characters. You've got to be kidding me. That's incredible, actually. What do you mean? Well, seriously, I, you can't tell this was made by people whose names you can't pronounce. I'm not going to say any... I'm not, I'm not, I guessed Serbian. Uh, that isn't necessarily correct. Yeah, and it's, well, then it, I, it's, it's the, actors, and then we have English voice actors. Oh, I see. That would help. Oh, Lady Vanilla. What did you know it? And then I didn't name that. It's just like, oh, these were the um, character models and not the people who spoke. Yeah. So otherwise, but again, the props just like you can't tell they're not American. Oh, they are all American. Oh, another way to tell I don't recognize anyone else. Steve is in England. John Michael Cook's come up a couple of times. Not sure who he is, but he was people. Name Manella again with an old woman. She is actually now probably. There was a narrator at some point. Who the heck is PC? I don't know. Is that us, maybe? Because I didn't see any us in there. Oh, well, I think we're at the end of the creds. Yep, that is, well, the main game. Yep, can there's, of course, uh, yeah, we know. There's the, uh, bonus game which we gain to eventually pretty much once we do the main game that's where we stop usually for in the recording session then we come back another day right because usually it depends on the game but like what what's left for us to do with this game uh, in this game it's 
actually kind of just a side plot that no one really cares about. Okay. But we'll probably have to do it, though, just to cover it. Okay. Speaking of that, we actually have some bonus content we never did in Dead Reckoning. Oh. So, well. I guess we could go do that now. Well, we haven't stopped the recording, <laughs> we're just starting to talk casually. Uh, thank you for watching, we'll see you in the bonus content of Myths of the World of Fiends and Fairies. Yep, and in our next game... Your...